know if you can write or raise hands because I was wondering like I tend to give quite a lot of input in these retreats and I'm wondering whether another guided meditation is needed or we should sit quietly so <laughs> someone put their hand up already so <laughs> okay so who votes for a silent meditation <laughs> and who votes for a slightly guided one okay all right so I'll I'll get you off hopefully on the right track Hopefully you will trust that and yeah, we're not looking for results. So forgive me if it doesn't work, it's not meant to work. And I'm just taking a moment for a sip of tea. Please also take a moment if you need to grab some water or yeah, put your shawl on. So really giving yourself all the time in the world to arrive, to settle into your body. And this time, just checking through your body fairly quickly just to check how you're seated and if there are any adjustments that you need to make. It might be possible to just lift your buttocks slightly in case anything is pressed or your hip is not aligned correctly. You may want to redistribute your weight so it falls more evenly on your buttocks or on your thighs if you're sitting on a chair. And I usually find that uh, if I'm sitting cross-legged, my legs are often crossed a little bit too tightly. So I just give my heels and shins a couple of centimeters more space. So making these small adjustments is not being fussy. It's really going deeper than that and giving your body the message that you care. That you're not pushing around your body. Treating it as a slave. But rather that you're treating it as a friend. And just to increase that sense of connection and friendship towards your body. Imagine smiling into your body, smiling into every cell. It might be a mental smile or even a smile that comes to your lips.
And see if you can notice how your body responds. Perhaps softening, relaxing a little bit more deeply. Or tingling. Perhaps a sense of warmth. And gently arriving in this present moment. This place where your whole life has brought you. Your whole life brought you to this point. And right now, in this moment, you have the opportunity to meet life, to meet yourself anew. As though this were the first moment you've ever really fully appreciated. Just receiving any sensations, thoughts, emotions, moods. As though they were just like passing clouds in the sky. And your body, your mind, is incredibly spacious. And grounded in this present moment. Unshaken by the winds, by the clouds in the sky.
just waiting in this moment without any agenda, expectation or demand. Lending a listening ear. Just accompanying each moment as it arises with a patient and forgiving mind. If you find that your mind could use a little bit more direction or guidance, you may like to offer some suggestions, some intentions to the mind. So I suggest a little rhyme that I came up with. See if it might work for you. May I be patient and open my heart. May I forgive and make a new start. May I be patient and open my heart. May I forgive and make a new start. And such intentions can be used to just gently 
Encourage the mind in the direction of peace. You might want to find your own words that resonate for you. And just repeat them internally as though you're dropping them in to the pool of your mind. You just drop them in and listen to the resonance of those words in your body and in your heart. Without looking for anything special, just trusting in those intentions to lead your mind towards peace. If any painful feelings arise, see if you can consent 
even welcome those feelings. There's restlessness, drowsiness. How would it feel to be patient with those winds in the mind? What is your relationship? to peace or to any happiness that might arise. Can you welcome that too? Consent to the bliss, allowing it in for as long as it wishes to stay without clinging, consenting to it passing away. Just a silent witness to whatever arises, listening in with an empathetic mind.
And if you find your mind wandering or becoming tense or tight, just forgive this moment, forgive your mind. And again and again, make a new start. So I'm going to allow those who wish to continue sitting. So I won't ring any bell. And if you prefer, you might wish to very gently, mindfully, quietly change your posture move into some walking meditation. So I'll give you the choice. It's now 20 to 3. And I would suggest meeting back here at 3 o'clock with a cup of tea for some question and answers. <laughs>